Hey there, guys and gals, and welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound. Where we last left off, we were about to start our epic planet-saving adventure, and it seems like our parents don't really seem to mind. So, without further ado, let's leave. I'm not entirely sure where we're going, though. Maybe we should go check the uh, this house over here, just to be sure. Oh, it's their, it's their parents. Maybe we should talk to them. Hey. Hello? Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. Silly me. Where in Sam Hill have you boys been? I'll have to think of a suitable punishment. Oh, boy. Uh, okay. I'm really sorry that my kids troubled you so much. Both of you are really going to get it now. Oh, they left. I wonder what you... Oh, dear. That noise did not sound pleasant. By the way... I would be happy if you left sometime soon. I'm tired of your family living next door. <laughs> My, nice way to be subtle about that, Mr. Neighbor. We loaned your father a lot of money. It may have been a hundred thousand dollars or more. Well, I guess it really could have been less. <laughs> but because of the loan, my family and I now live in poverty. My husband is much too lenient with the children. Oh well, nice guys finish last. That's the story of our life. What? Hey! I think it's a dung beetle! I'll smash your guts out! No, not Buzz Buzz, no! No, Buzz Buzz! No. No. Are you okay, Buzz Buzz? Oh, I, I don't want to talk. Buzz Buzz! Oh, exclamation point, he's alright. I guess I was much weaker than I thought. You, you took out that Starman Jr., no trouble, and you get slapped once and you're, you're dying? So you must now begin your adventure. See? You. Oh, I just remembered. Listen to my final words. To defeat Gigas, or Gigas, I don't know, your own power must unite with the Earth's. The Earth will then channel your power. And multiply it. There are eight points that you must visit. Make these places your own. Each of these locations is your sanctuary. One of them is near on it. It is called Giant Step. Go there first. Do you understand? All right. You are a very intelligent young man. And oh, the pain. Everything is getting dark. <clears throat> Before I pass on, I want to give you something. It is a sound stone. You can record the melodies from the eight your sanctuary locations into this stone. It is an awesome item. By the way, I, well, I'm almost gone. But you hear the story one more time? Uh, I don't want to hear the story one more time. Good! It's already dawn outside. But it doesn't matter to me. I'm fading fast. Uh, uh. Ness got the soundstone. Oh, he just faded away. Seems like a major character just died, but... Oh, well. Sigh. I'm so tired. Nag, nag, nag. My husband is very soft-hearted. I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> with these people. My dad really got after me. He said no dessert for the rest of the decade. Huh. Tough break, kid. Looks like you could use a few pounds, though. I don't want to look at the meteorite anymore. Are you okay, lame guys? You were going to go help me on my adventure, but I guess not. Just let your parents rule your lives, eh? Well, they're a lot less strict than... Well, Nessa's parents don't really care, do they? It is now dawn, and the beginning of a new adventure. The music's slightly different, too. At least they care about their kids. Maybe I'm in a bit sort of an authoritative way, but... Oh! Vanessa's par parents just seem to... do whatever, Have him do whatever he wants. Ouch. This runaway dog is hurting me. Never mind. Wasn't too hard. 4 XP. Well, sure, Ness's parents might not seem to be the most strict parents, but at least they 
you know, send him money every now and again and fe force feed him steak whenever he wants it or doesn't want it, if that would be the case. This might be on it. I don't know. I'm not sure what the signs are saying. Can I go into every house? Are you this? My son said something about going to a hideout. I don't know what he was talking about. Oh, I can't go into every house, so that makes sense now. Oh, I can go in this house, apparently. Hello? Mr. Lear X Agri, the treasure hunter, finally found something interesting. I heard he would only show it to you. Oh yeah, I forgot. The creepy dude at the top of the mountain. I forgot all about him. Maybe it's best that I did. Hello, miss. The town is out of control. The wild boys are hanging out in the town, and the cops have really been cracking down on everyone. I'm considering moving to Toasted, a town to the south. Or Tucson. Oh, Tucson. Yeah, Tucson. Tucson, Arizona. Get it? Well, I'm just gonna cut ahead to the creepy man on top of the mountain. And here we are at the so-called treasure hunter's house. On the way up here, I got quite a bit of loot, got into quite a few random battles, and I leveled up. Let's head inside. You might want to patch up this floor a bit, don't you think? I'm doing this because I trust you. First, let's go to the basement. Am I sure I want to go to the basement with this guy? Ah, I can tell by the look on your face you don't want to hang out, do you? That's alright. After all, we're not even related. Wait, what? I know you think I'm a big liar, but maybe I'll surprise you. Yeah, I don't want to be surprised by you. Uh, this is a big basement. You've been a busy boy, haven't you? Can I take the shovel? No. I am disappointed. A shovel would make a pretty decent weapon, compared to a cracked bat. Hmm. On and on and on, through the tunnels, into... I have no idea. So, Ness, buddy, I found proof of a great treasure. A huge haul. Yeah, <laughs> I'll show you, but you're the only one. Come on. Uh, I'll go into the dark room with you. Sure. Oh, maybe there is treasure. If this is a sign of what lies below, I just need a little time. My destiny is to find and dig up the buried treasure. I'll eat garlic and work out to help strengthen myself. Go home now. You're getting in the way of my work. You may start to get greedy thoughts. Hmm. Can I check it? The golden statue is glowing strangely. And it makes weird music play. Hmm. Maybe I have to use the sounding stone on it. Do I have the sounding stone? Yes, I do. Sound stone. Not sounding stone. Use. Ness touched the sound stone to his forehead and gathered his thoughts. Whoa. Uh. I have no idea what just happened. Anything different? Hmm. Strange. Well, I suppose there's nothing I can do here yet. Do you say anything differently? No. I wasn't getting too greedy yet. Hmm. So, I have to use a soundstone to find the sanctuaries. And that'll help defeat Gigas. That is interesting, but I'm sure it'll... I'm sure it'll come into play later. Whatever it is. Maybe when he started to dig around the area and find more treasure, I'll have to come back here and stuff. No problem here. That's a very ratty looking bed. I ran into a crap load of random encounters on the way here. And sometimes, I guess I'm so powerful that it just cancels out certain random encounters. I don't know. Because sometimes when I run into certain enemies, they just die immediately. I don't even have to fight them or anything. I've also been getting a crap load of cookies. And I better not eat all of them. I'll get pretty fat if I do that. Might give some to Sister, but they aren't very good healing items anyway. They're not even as good as potions are in a Final Fantasy game. Only 6 HP? That's not really anything when you've got around 50. I'll pay a visit to Dad. Oh, what? Uh, what's going on? Pictures taken instantaneously! I'm a photographic genius, if I do say so myself. 
Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready? Say, Fuzzy Pickles! Wow, what a great photo photograph! It will always bring back the fondest of memories. Seriously, what just happened? What just happened? I, I just don't know anymore. Can you force feed me some steak, Ma? You're back! Don't bother yourself with talking now. You look too tired. Mothers understand these things. Eat some steak and scoot off to bed. Mmm, steak. Delish.